Hello everybody and welcome to US Computer Solutions for another how-to tutorial. My name is Joey. Today I'll be showing you how to assemble the vertical bracket so you can have a beautiful GPU card sitting vertically in your computer. So let's get started. Now what we're going to do is over here is we are going to unscrew this panel and remove the screws for the PCIe card and get it out. Now for those of you who already knows how to do this stuff, you, you can skip to the timestamp of the installation part. Now for those of you who has never removed a graphic card from the computer, I highly recommend that you continue the video and watch it because a disclaimer over here, if you don't do it correctly, you will break this inside of your motherboard. First thing we're going to do is we're going to remove the screw over here. And we are going to remove this panel. This panel covers the screws. And we're going to unscrew these. There's two screws over here, uh, holding a PCIe for me, a uh, Wi-Fi. I'm gonna remove it in the process. And of course, I'm going to unscrew my VGA card. I'm going to remove the power supply PSU unit and there's a little lever over here there's a few don't uh, push down on this to release the graphic card you will break it so you need to press carefully on it like this and then we're going to carefully pull up our graphic card from inside of our computer there is no force involved in this and if you see that it's still hanging on that means you still need to press more Here's our graphic card out. As you see in the box, we have this vertical GPU holder. Now I'm gonna throw this out of there. Now this does not fit in the computer. I'm going to install it in. This will be only a demonstration and it will be only a assembly. Uh, unfortunately, I have the big Nikotua fan and the cable for the PSU does not fit. So in order, if you have a normal radiator or a water cooling system, this will fit perfectly in your computer and you will have that beautiful vertical look for that graphic card. So for those of you who are thinking I'm, I'm going to start it and I won't be able to start it on my computer, but this is assembly for the vertical so you can have an idea how to assemble it. Now as you see, first thing out of the box, we have the PCIe with the cable over here. And we have this GPU holder or mount. And we have these two mounts, they're magnetic. These, these will sit in your case and hold it down. And of course we have some screws and this is just a foam to protect the device. All right, so the first thing I'm going to do is I will install this mount on this side over here in order for it to maneuver first, but this is the easiest part, so that's why. Let's get that screwed in. Let's get the screw screwed in. Now we don't want to tighten this all the way. We need to be able to maneuver it and tilt it while it's inside the computer. This, this is how it's going to look. Okay. I like to install this first on our GPU like this. Let me show you like this. And it should look like this. The GPU should be on top of it. Like that. And let me screw. And let me screw the other part. Now these came from our computer from when we uninstalled the GPU. Okay, and now let's install this here. A very simple method. Uh, we need to make sure that this lever is unlocked in order for our PCIe to be correctly inserted. Okay, so let's get that clicked in and it's locked in place and now while it's locked in place let's bring the other mount and click it back in place final part and it should be like this feels 
good to me. And there you have it. This is how to assemble it. And now let's get our computer in and I'll show you how to plug everything in place without actually running it. Now, well, I can't run it, but I'll have to run it in my hands. And I'll show you. All right, so here's our computer and this is where we're gonna plug that in. Make sure that this lever over here is open. Now, as you see, there is a cover over here. This cover, we're going to remove it and slightly insert it in. And as you see, I barely have any space from that fan. And I can just put it in, but I can't insert the PSU cable from here. So what I have to do is I have to leave it up or keep my case open and that's not going to happen but I'll show you how it looks like so here's the PSU cable let's plug that in and as you see this is how it looks like so it should look like this in your computer if it actually can fit now if you had a radiator here all you will have is this little pipe coming up from uh, CPU and going to the radiator or cooling system I have this huge fan that's going on over here I can't even run it the cables for the monitors will come from this side yes from this opening over here that we have open where th this was mounted on okay and it should look perfectly like this of course with this cable on and then we will power it now okay guys so i hope you enjoyed this video please comment subscribe and share and see you again next time for another how to tutorial you guys have a wonderful day